Hello and uh, welcome to uh, uh, Axis Community. I think this is the this is 16th informal. Only Steve's not heard it's informal. He's got his suit on. Bless. But, and these guys, you'll forgive them. But um, welcome to Axis Community. Yeah, it's the 16th uh, informal event of this type that we've run. Probably about the 20th, including the sort of big meal events that we've done. Um, uh, welcome to the new people. It's hopefully uh, not not too scary. It's quite a quite a friendly group. Um, some very quick announcements, really. The first thing is that uh, thanks to some uh, rather direct lobbying on certain people's behalves, we've finally managed to secure uh, a building outside of the main college premises. Yay! Fantastic. We're going into uh, uh, Middle Street Business Centre, which is, is owned by the college, and uh, we're, we're just having a bit of an, uh, a scrap as to which bit of the, the building we get. We're going for the top floor, which is the sort of penthouse, mezzanine, all that kind of thing. It's the nicest bit. But so we've got some courses launching that are called eBusiness Insights, which are kind of mini versions of, of all the courses we do from uh, Photoshop right through to sort of Google, uh, all sorts of exciting stuff. And we've been chasing this uh, venerable signing over here as a sort of Teddy Sheringham of, of the footballing world. Still got it. And uh, this is Steve Wakelin, who, who some of you might know from the Independent Business Association, is the chief executive of the IBA, who's joined us uh, for two days a week to help build the uh, eBusiness Insights and also uh, act as a sort of ambassador for the community. That we've just won uh, a transnational bid to work with and lead uh, a large body of colleges in developing community, developing Axis community. We've got quite a sum of money to spend on redeveloping the Axis community website. It's not, yes. did a good job. <laughs> God oh, bless him, developed it in his own spare time and has maintained it in his own spare time. But we've got a chance to kind of create um, a, a radically better website that's going to help us sort of collaborate with each other much more. I think it's one big piece of feedback that we, we've had is that um, we don't kind of know each other really in the community. We sort of turn up and vaguely know faces. So one of the big things we're going to try and do is sort of give each business a profile in there and uh, allow them to sort of, uh, in a kind of LinkedIn way, if anybody uses that, uh, to connect up with each other. Yeah. Fantastic. Here we go. Right. This. This. We're. We're very honoured. Um, if, if the meter's running, I'm worried at this point because we've got three big hitters from uh, Berryman's, which was Berryman Shacklocks. Is that right? Still is technically. T still is technically right. Okay. I cannot recommend this group of solicitors enough because they got me off the charge about ten years ago. It was a misunderstanding. <laughs> I'm serious. This was a, a complete misunderstanding, and uh, a, a smart young man turned up, and, uh, and, and it was all sorted in about ten minutes flat. So uh, I can't recommend them enough. And uh, we've got uh, Gavin, Ellie, and uh, Stephen from, from Berryman's here. Ellie's uh, an expert in, um, I was about to say, internet protocol. <laughs> intellectual property. Yes, my, my kind of IP, yeah, intellectual property. So uh, Ellie will be around at the end to uh, uh, perhaps do a few minutes on, uh, on intellectual property and answer your questions. But the uh, main trick... Uh, of the night is, is Gavin who's going to be looking at uh, data protection. I'm going to let you go and say something in a minute. The reason why this is important is that we, we've put together um, we're going to put together three events. This is the first in three events that are about direct marketing and email marketing in particular. As more and more of the sort of methods, traditional methods, I don't know whether you're noticing are starting to kind of fail the press ads uh, and all the other stuff. It's going to be more and more important that you get people to opt in uh, and then you market to them with their permission, and this is what this this first kind of phase is about, really. That's enough from me, Saul. And you across to uh, Gavin. Thanks a lot.